At their best New York fans are passionate and rowdy. At their worst they are boorish, and unoriginal. Through three days, at the PGA Championship they mostly leaned toward the former. On Sunday, they spilled over into the latter. Specifically when it came to the treatment of Brooks Kepka. As Kepka's victory march took a turn to madness on Sunday evening, the Long Island Gallery flipped on the 29-year-old. There were screams of choke in his direction, along with a number of vulgarities involving his girlfriend. Perhaps worse was a series of Dustin Johnson chants, while Kepka was on way to making bogey at the 14th. Those derisions backfired, as Kepka credited the jeers, to keeping him focused down the stretch. I tell you what. The hour spent from number 11 to 14 was interesting, Kepka said in his victory press conference. When they started chanting, DJ on 14 it actually kind of helped, to be honest with you. I think it helped me kind of refocus, and hit a good one down 15. However one player didn't take those words as kindly as Kepka. That would be Harold Varner 3, who was in the final pairing with Kepka on Sunday. It's a pretty crazy day. I thought it was pretty weird. How they were telling Brooks to choke, Varner said. That's not my cup of tea. I was pulling for him after that. I have a few choice words for that.